land conservation in Florida is critically important. Uh, we need to have places, obviously, to recreate, uh, for wildlife, to, to have it, uh, inhabit. Um, and also, we need places to protect our, our water resources. So the, the property that we're on today, Canaan Ranch, uh, is on a, an area that has very high recharge. That means when rain falls, it's, it's going through the soil, it's not being evaporated or transpired, and working its way through the soil, through the limestone, and getting back into our aquifer, which then, then allows us to have our, our springs and keep our, our rivers flowing. Um, and so by protecting this piece of property and not having it get turned into some other heavier uh, industrial land use, um, we have the opportunity to ensure that that water is actually flowing through and when it's going into the aquifer that it stays clean and we don't, we don't need to go through a process of you know, pulling nutrients or other things out of that water. It's a unique area. It's one of the most unique areas in the state and in the world. If you think about the number of magnitude, first magnitude springs. So uh, to come out here on this tour to see these recharge areas, how important they are to the springs and long-term protection of those. So uh, it's a it's both an environmental issue plus it's an economic issue to attract people to come here. Uh, a lot of people uh, don't think of Florida as a springs area. They think of beaches or Disney. I think we have an obligation an opportunity to really educate uh, other people on the uniqueness of this area. North Florida is that you've got amazing natural freshwater springs that are mixed in with working lands, agricultural lands, natural lands, state parks and forests, and that mosaic ensures that you've got the amount of water you need uh, to flow out of the springs and also hopefully the quality of water. But that's only if you can protect these natural areas. Um, if that becomes developed or is too intense um, agriculture, you can start having problems with nutrients um, impacting our springs. And so protecting these pristine areas is one of the most important things we can do uh, to protect our springs for future generations.